Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie wizard of Oz himself. And I'm here at AMC Theaters at the Grove. Oh, this is such an awesome place to be here. So I'm here to discuss my review of, of the new MCU, MCU movie entry that was outstanding despite its Rotten Tomatoes score. Eternals. Eternals was awesome. Starring this ultimate cast with Gemma Chan, Richard Madden, Don Lee, Kumali Najani, Johnny, Brian Tree Henry, Kit Harrington. Salma Hayek and Angelina Jolie. Oh, what an awesome cast. Maybe the night the motives might let me know All the stars are closed sure. All... I'm so fancy You already know I'm in I just love it. This, even though Rotten Tomatoes gave it a horrible score, I don't give a blind well, you know the rest. I just don't care about the score for Rotten Tomatoes. Screw them. I think Eternals was awesome as hell. It was epic, it was studied. I love the CGI and all that jazz. I mean, I get why the movie was so long. It, it has, it, it get to have all the Eternals to shine in this movie. It get, it has all the actors to shine in this. It's amazing. I mean, this is like no other MCU movie. Like, for example, we get to see a, we get to see a brief sex scene, and they broke, they broke the ante by adding an LGBTQ couple in this movie. But, but it did have some, sh and it did have some shocking twist, twist on who the real bad guys were, besides the Deviants. I gotta say, say the Eternals and the Deviants, that those fight, fights were amazing. Say, especially the one in the forest. I really did love that one. But I was shocked of the, of the death scenes we have here. It really shocked me. So. So. And I could see why. And I was kind of right about my theory of how the Eternals were worshipped as gods. Because it makes sense with the names though. I mean, Icarus who flew who flew too close to the sun. Gilgamesh, the Mesopotamian hero who is like a, who is like Hercules. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Hercules? I mean, Circe, as in the witch, witch who transforms anything that is matter. Not to mention... Not to mention Thena, or should I say, Athena, the Greek goddess of, the, of war and, and wisdom. Makes me that much stronger Makes me work a little bit harder I mean, I just love Angela, Angelina Jolie as, as, as Thena. Whether she's from a, whether she's the dark fairy or, or a Marvel hero, she, she was badass. I love her. I really did love the other, the other Eternals' powers, like Makari as, Makari with her super speed. She definitely gives the Flash and Quicksilver a run for their money. And I just realized that Makari 
if you if you rearrange the words, you will get Mercury as in the god as in the god of speed. Whoa. Oh what else? Mm. Let's see. Oh, and I really did love the love the big credits, the the post credit scenes. I would. I'm not gonna tell you any spoilers, but one of them showed showed a terrific, terrific new actor in this in that movie. But I'm not gonna tell you. Mm -mm. <sighs> I do hope we get to see the Eternals again, Eternals in another, in another movie, or, or what was, I would love to see some, I would love to see them teaming up with the Avengers, if they do make an event, a fifth Avengers movie. Oh, uh, okay then, okay. So for my score for Eternals, I think doing is quite beautiful. It might be. It might be slow, but not that much, but it was okay. I mean, we get to, I mean, I wouldn't blame them because they had to tell the stories of what happened in the past. Past? And, and it was quite unique with, with its visual effects. I love it. Love it. I love the thermography. I love the costume designs for the Eternals. They were fabulous. I gotta say, when it comes to living the entire years, years in different in different countries, they look fabulous in everything. So I think I'll give Eternals an eight. Definitely an eight. I was gonna give this a seven point five or a seven and a half, but I think an eight will be good. Okay you guys, I guess that's it. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you all stay safe, stay healthy, and make sure you all see Eternals this weekend. Bye.